Good morning everyone. This is teacher Joanna and I will be your teacher in values. Now before we start our lesson, let us let us first have these words. Are you ready? Very good. So everyone, let us read discord. Again, discord. Next we have enmity. Everyone, let us read enmity. And then we have monotonous. Everyone, let us read monotonous. And then we have adornment. Everyone, let us read adornment. So the words are discord, enmity, monotonous, and adornment. So do you know the meaning of the words? Okay, so let us know the meaning of the words, everyone. When we say discord, this is disagreement between people. That is the meaning of discord. When we say en enmity, it is opposed to someone. That is the meaning of enmity. And then when we say monotonous, lacking in variety and interest. That is monotonous. And then when we say adornment, decoration of color. So those are the meaning of the words. Okay? So... Before, any, um, before anything else, what was our lesson last meeting? It was all about concern for others. Now, did you apply it to yourselves? Okay, to your daily lives? Very good. So today, we are going to talk about a um, new lesson. And that lesson is all about respecting the opinion of others. Again, um, respecting but this time we're going um, we're going to talk about how to respect the opinions of others now I want you to remember still that respecting is taking someone's feelings needs thoughts ideas wishes and preferences into co consideration that is respecting you consider the feelings the needs, the thoughts, the ideas, the wishes and preferences of other people. Do you understand me? Okay, very good. So, we are going to talk about respecting the opinion of other people. Now, respecting others' opinion shows that you think persons have value. Now, if you respect others' opinion, you show that you think you show that you think persons or other people have value and that you want to make it known to them that you do. Okay? So you you want it you want to make known to them that you know that they have value. Do you understand me? Okay, very good. So Respecting others' opinion is important. Why? Because by allowing people to communicate to one another, we are all putting the cornerstone from where we can live in peace and harmony. Okay? So the word peace and harmony. If you respect others' opinion, then we are all putting the cornerstone where we can live in a peaceful and harmonious um, surroundings. Do you understand? Okay, so we respect other people. Okay, we um do you respect other people? Very good. Okay, so if you respect him or her, you listen. Okay, so the way you can show that you respect other people is that you listen to them. Okay, you listen to them. For example, your teacher. You listen to your teacher, your mother. Your mother is telling you something. You listen to your mother. Your friend is telling you something. Then you listen to your friend. Okay? So, you listen to his or her opinion and then you weigh it honestly. Okay? So, you listen first and then you weigh it honestly and then you make your own decision. Okay? Listening to them doesn't mean that you agree. Okay? Sometimes we agree and we disagree. That's why we listen because um, the moment they are finished telling you what, what they want to say, you will weigh it. Okay? You will weigh it if, if you agree to that or you disagree to that. And then, uh, the end part is that you make your own decision. Okay? The very important thing is that you listen to those people who are telling you something. Do you understand? Okay, so again, if you respect other people, then you listen to them. And then, 
you listen to their opinion, and then you wait honestly, and the end part is that you make your own decision. It's up to you if you agree or you disagree. Do you understand? Okay, very good. So you may voice out your disagreement. If you don't agree, then you can voice it out. Okay? It's our freedom. Okay? But it won't become full-blown argument because we can respect each other's differing opinions. Okay? So, okay? So, if you disagree to whatever that person told you, okay, you may voice it out. Do you understand me? Remember that it will not become full-blown argument because we um, you showed respect to one another. You listened to him or her, okay? You wait, you wait it honestly, and then you made your decision to disagree or to agree. Do you understand me? Okay, very good. So, there is unity in diversity, okay? So, teacher, what's the meaning of that? So, person will always be different from one another. Remember that a person is unique or one of a kind. Okay? So, people are different because they have different ethnic origins. Therefore, they have different cultural norms and tradition. Do you understand? So, we are, um, we have different ethnic origins. All of us. Okay, it what that's what makes us different from other people. Do you understand me? Okay, so you are unique. Okay, so you are one of a kind. So we also vary in religion, in customs, and in beliefs. For example, Teacher Joanna is a um, born again. Okay, what's your religion? Okay, so some of you are Roman Catholic. Some of you are Iglesia ni Cristo. Okay? Okay, so we vary. Okay, in the, um in religion, we have different religions. Okay? It doesn't mean that you're a Filipino, you're um a Filipino should should um be Roman Catholic all of us know. Okay? So we we vary in religion, in custom, in beliefs. So, um, we believe something that other people don't believe. So, it doesn't matter, okay? So, as long as you just listen to them and then you ask them why, okay? And don't judge other people, okay? Don't judge them. Just because they don't have, um, you, okay, both of you don't have the same belief. Do you understand me? Okay, so this is what makes every person unique and therefore special and one of a kind. So that is what makes person unique or one of a kind. So we are all different, but still there is unity in our differences because we are all Filipino. Do you understand? Okay, so we are all different. Okay, let's accept that. We are all different. We look different, okay? Can um can you imagine the face of your brother? Okay, so um do you have the same face as your brother? Okay, so no. Okay, some of you, yes, some of you know. Okay, so I can imagine the face of my sister where we don't look alike, okay? So we look different, okay? Some of us come from different cultures, remember that. Some of us are able to do things other people cannot. And though these differences may be very obvious, it is important for all of us to treat each other respectfully despite our differences. Okay, so what should you remember? Treat each other respectfully despite our differences. Now, as we all have similar needs and feelings, we may look different, um, we may not have the same culture, but we must treat each other respectfully despite our differences. Do you understand me? Okay, very good. So, we need to, re to respect, we need to respect to cooperate. Okay, so it goes hand in hand. To respect, to cooperate, and live in a peaceful 
world. Okay, that is why we need to listen to others um, of what they are saying. So what 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 should we do? Listen to what others are saying. Okay, so we need to allow others to speak out their mind, and while their ideas may be different from ours. We need to respect their opinion just as we expect others to do the same to us. So there is a saying, whatever you do to other people, um, that's what you will get from them. Do you understand? It's give and take. You give them respect, they give you respect as well. Do you understand me? Okay, so one of the most imp important values and skills we need to learn is listening so what is the most important values and skills we need to learn listening again what is that listening very good so listening shows respect okay so um what shows respect listening okay so when you pay attention to what others have to say you send them the message that you value them if you listen you send you send them the message that you value them Okay? Okay, when you listen to them, you show them that you respect them. If you are listening to other people, then you show other people that you respect them. Do you understand? Okay, very good. So listening builds relationship. So what does um listening builds? Relationship. Very good. So by becoming a good listener, you are able to connect and therefore develop greater confidence in themselves. Do you understand? Okay, so again, listening builds what? Relationship. Listening shows respect. Very good. Listening builds also loyalty. So what is, what is the other um, listening builds? loyalty okay so loyalty binds people okay it binds people and allows them to seek ways they can commit to important causes in the world do you understand okay so that is um respecting other people's opinions so again what is respect okay it is taking someone's feelings needs thoughts ideas wishes and preferences in consideration what does listening builds relationship and loyalty what does listening shows respect so we should always respect other people's opinion okay listen to their opinion weigh it honestly and then make your own decision okay whether you agree or disagree it's up to you do you understand me okay very good so i have your question what is respect okay everyone respect is taking someone's feelings needs thoughts ideas wishes and preferences into consideration so what does respecting other people others opinion show um respecting other opinion shows respect okay very good so what did you learn today today we have learned about respecting other other people's opinions so respecting means taking someone's feelings needs wishes thoughts ideas preferences into consideration now listening builds loyalty and um relationship and listening shows respect okay so we have to listen to other people's opinions so what we give to them is what they will give to us also so if you respect them then they will respect you also do you understand so if you really understand the lesson let us proceed to your practice exercise answer activity a page 109 that is your practice exercise and here is your evaluation answer activity b page 110 so don't forget to answer your practice exercise and your evaluation because teacher joanna will check it do you understand me okay very good so here is your assignment how can you show respect to others opinion okay so don't forget to do your assignment because i'm going to check it as well so thank you for listening see you in the next video bye bye